turns attention away from the real problem. But the reality is, which source does emit more CO2, volcanoes or humans? Well, there's the numbers for you. You know, 135 to 230 times more is emitted by human. So volcanoes really can't be the culprit. So if the climate crisis was being caused by human activity, the oil and coal companies might not be able to dump all their global warming pollution into the sky. You know, we might have to stop treating the sky as a sewer for global warming pollution. Just like we did 100, 150 years ago, we decided it wasn't a really good idea to dump our pollution into waterways. We've got to get that same mind frame that the sky is not a sewer. But we know where all the money comes from. Help brothers. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so isn't there something else we can blame it on? It's called sunspots. Yes, solar activity. That explains why one sees similar temperature cycles on Mars and Jupiter to the cycles that are happening on this planet. That's why ice caps on those planets, like on ours, expand and contract. It's the sun, stupid. <laughs> oh yeah, and these people are in government. Uh, first of all, uh, there are no ice caps on Jupiter. <laughs> so, another red herring. But if we look at solar energy, solar activity, in fact, it has been going down slightly in the past 30 years. So as temperatures go up, solar activity has stayed the same or gone down slightly. So there's really not a connection there. So it's an eligible effect on climate. There are, there are many, many fingerprints for climate change, not just climate models. In fact, here are a dozen of different sources of independent evidence which are used to reconstruct climate. so many science awards. Sometimes we get talking about high food and science, things like this, and people are like, what are you talking about? So let me just break it down. Carbon, carbon dioxide is basically this. <sighs> Look how much pollution I just put out. Yeah, okay. Is, is a carcinogen that's harmful to our environment, it, it's almost comical. Yeah. Yeah. Who said, who said that CO2 is a carcinogen? 